Hello everyone, welcome to IMC. In this video, I will discuss an important topics differentiation. Very important topics of calculus. Differentiation. This is the process of a function by which apply and we find the derivative of any function. So topic note one differentiation coefficient differential coefficient of fx is denoted by f dash x. This is the differential coefficient derivative. How coming from where? Let's start. Y equals to fx. Take y equals to fx. Okay. This y equals to fx. If slight change, if if slight change of x, small change, very very small change of x, then Marlow delta x. Then this will be f of x plus delta x. Then a small amount also change of y, that is y plus del y. Okay. And this function put a and this function is b. This equation a and this equation b. And if we subtract this, this will be, this will be, and this will be, this will be del y is f of x plus del x minus, this will be minus, then this is minus fx. Okay. And now minute del x change. Now minute. Now, minute del x, that is, del x tends to 0. If del x is very small, tends to 0, tending to 0, then del will be del y upon del x. This is limiting value. When del x tends to 0, this is del x tends to 0. This is f of x plus del x minus fx upon del x. This changing is known as f dash x differential coefficient that is limit of del y upon del x when del x tends to 0. So this is called derivative of a function f dash x differential coefficient f dash x is the this ratio when del x tends to 0 limiting value. So this is the ratio differential coefficient okay <coughs> when ratio del y del x to define things okay. It is also the rate of change of y with respect to x, that is dy by dx. Also the rate of change of y with respect to x. So dy by dx, you can say limiting value of del y upon del x when del x tends to 0. And this is also you can take dy, where d belongs to ddx. This is a whole thing, ddx. So in the in the differential equation take like this dy upon 1 plus x square and dx upon under root of 1 minus x square how it is dy dy board look very so sakte dy by dx a dy upon dx this is not equals to dy division dy ये अलग नहीं हो सकता है लेकिन ये अलग हो रहा है ये अलग है dy by dx मींस del y upon del x इसको रिप्रेजेंट करने के लिए dy dx बोल, बोल सकता है दैट इज ddx of y ओके सो ddx एक जो गोटा जिनिस ये एक गोटा जिनिस जो dy dx मींस है एक्चुअली dy और dx ये तो अलग हो सकता है ना ये तो थोड़ा डिफाइंड हो सकता है ना लेकिन dy dx गोटा जिनिस इसको रिप्रेजेंट करने के लिए हम बोल रहे हैं dy बता रहे dy by dx clear dx upon dy is limit of del x upon del y when del y tends to 0 so this is also 1 upon limit of del y upon del x when del x tends to 0 so this is 1 upon 1 by dy by dx so dx upon dy upon means 1 upon dy by dx may ek baat batana chahta hu please keep watch Keep watch this video up to the end for full conception and more important questions. Okay. And but d2x upon dy2 not equal to 1 upon dy2 upon dx2. Okay. So dx upon dy is 1 upon dy by dx, but not double derivative not equal to 1 upon dy by dx2. It is remember this is more important. Let's start question. And a question if fx 1 minus cos x 
upon 1 minus sin x then dy by dx what will be the value at x equals to pi by 2 f dash x is 1 minus sin x whole square and this is 1 minus sin x and this is derivative of 1 minus cos x is also sin x and 1 minus 1 minus cos x and this is minus cos x okay but here carefully observe that at x equals to pi by 2 not belongs to the domain domain of this function domain of this function x equals to pi by 2 not belongs to domain of this function because when we put x equals to pi by 2 here then this will be the denominator is 0 that is which is undefined so x equals to pi by 2 not belongs to domain so at x equals to pi by 2 at this differentiable does not exist because at the x equals to pi by 2 not belongs to domain so at x equals to pi by 2 this function is discontinuous that is a discontinuous function cannot be differentiable so this function is nd that is not differentiable this function is not differentiable that is no value of this function derivative of this function at x equals to pi by 2 okay let's say another question question if y equals to log of sin x minus 2 then di upon dx what will be the value let's start the solution carefully observe logarithm of sin x sin x maximum value is 1 so if we put here 1 then this will be negative okay so this function is does not exist so does not exist does not exist this function so this function is also not differentiable not differentiable nd okay this function is also not differentiable let's an important question if y equals to x mod x box x this is the gi greatest integer function greatest integer function then value of dy by dx at x belongs to not belongs to z not belongs to z z means integer integer set okay so what is the derivative when at x not belongs to z since you know the box function that is greatest integer function is not differential at the point where the function is integer at the integer point this is not differentiable at, at the integer because at the integer at integer value this uh, greatest integer function is discontinuous as well as not differentiable breaking point so but this derivative not belongs to the integer point not belongs to the integer point that is not integer point this function may be differentiable so what will be the derivative you know box x means always an integer like this n let integer where n is an integer okay so y equals to x nx so derivative of y is n and derivative of x is 1 so this is a box x so derivative of this function is this is the answer okay let's an another important important question and this is the last constant and for Having more important questions and solutions, please keep watch my next video. And this question is if fx is x square sin 1 upon x when x not equals to 0 and this is 0 when x equals to 0, find, find f dash 0. That is if fx this function then what will be the value derivative at the point x equals to 0 okay so let's important solution carefully observe this solution if we derivative at the product rule then this is x square cos of 1 upon x and derivative 1 upon x is minus 1 upon x square plus sin 1 upon x multiplied by 2x derivative of x square is 2x but here carefully observe when x tends to 0 when x is 0 then this will be f0 is 0 square and after putting here x square x square is cancelled 
okay so when x equals to 0 and this will be cos 1 upon 0 that is infinity then this value is minus 1 to 1 and this will be x0 and this will be minus 1 to 1 multiplied by 0 so a finite value and multiplied by 0 this will be total is 0 so 0 plus minus 1 is which one is minus 1 minus 1 to 1 this is the not correct that is infinite okay so in this type of function where x not equals to 0 in this type of function if we cannot derivative in this way and in this question it is important defensible this function is defensible okay you know this function is defensible so defensible was hotteo this function cannot defensible in this way now in this process f dash 0 will be differentiate x tends to 0 f of x minus f 0 and this is x minus 0 and this will be limit of fx that is x square x square sine 1 upon x minus f0 means 0 upon x and this is x0 and this x x is cancel and this will be limit x sine upon 1 upon x and x tends to 0 and this is 0 multiplied by minus 1 to 1 that is 0 so value of this derivative at the point x equal to 0 is 0 so 0 is the answer okay so please keep watch my next video for remaining solutions of the questions having more important questions stay tuned stay tuned with this channel